So God, I said, I have no desire to be this weak believer. So what is happening with me? All my confidence is just has just gone down the drain completely. I would get very frustrated in a lot of situations because I consider myself a very confident person. I didn't hesitate to make decisions. I felt very sure of myself when I walked into rooms. I didn't second guess my ability to do things. I just did it. But somewhere along the way, when I gave my life to the Lord and I started to follow him, I, be, I started to second guess everything about me. Well, I don't know if it's the right timing or, or what if God is not pleased with me or, or what if I'm making a mistake or, or what if this is not the right way? All these questions. And I told the Lord, I said, I don't desire to be this weak, insecure believer who can't make decisions and doesn't know who they are and isn't sure of themselves. I feel so insecure here, but I used to feel so confident in everything. Wait a second. We have to look at what you thought your confidence was rooted in. He said, because it was actually rooted in insecurity. You might've been confident in the person that you thought you were, but was that your true identity? And I was like, okay, here are my edges. What I'm doing is I'm removing the false sense of confidence that you used to have. And in its place, I'm refilling an unshakable confidence in your true identity. He said, you're looking at situations now, like I don't know how to respond to this because the old me used to do it a certain way. You were confident in that old person. So now you're second guessing yourself. He said, but the only reason you're doing that is because I'm removing the false sense of confidence that you had that was actually rooted in bondage.